with anything. Yeah. Like you told me a few times, like, dude, you're not being yourself. Why do you think you were throwing so much slower when you were with the Pirates? I, I don't know, just like normal like confidence stuff. Like when you first get into the league, you know what I mean? It's like, yeah, we, you, I've heard you, I've seen all your features. I've seen all your, all your good job momentum. I've seen it all. Yeah. I'm part of the, uh, yeah, there you go. Uh, I remember seeing it like, it's kind of like you try to conform and like you get into that certain, like I don't really want to step on anyone's toes. Like I've worked my whole life to get to this moment and like I, I really want to make the most out of it. And I think the moment you realize you're kind of like, dude, I'm myself. Like what makes me unique is what makes me unique, right? And I came to the league and like I have my own skill set, and like I'm gonna let that show as opposed to like what I want to conform to. And I think the second I got to like, let's just go out and play baseball, I was like, all right, it's all kind of hands on deck here. Yeah, I, think, I mean, just minus just like getting comfortable like mindset was, I think it was just having, it was like the whole time coming up, even when I was throwing hard, it was like we were always trying different things to refine. And I still felt yeah. so lost in the process besides all I, what I had was a good arm and I was strong and I was like, Yeah, dude. All right, so if you're yeah. saying that, I'll do that. You're saying this, I'll do that. And then I started hearing barrels get cracked and that's when I was like, oh, I didn't do this. That's like, I mean, like, like with anything though, like when you're in your most like, I don't know, like moments of like, you're kind of, your confidence dips in a bit and you're just like, you're in search mode. Cause I mean like, dude, with no matter how well you do in a season, like, a guy with a, like a one five or a guy with a five five. There's moments in the season to where you're like, oh, wow, you second guess yourself. You know what I mean? Like whether it's start to start or like month to month. And I think like the best ones are the ones that just kind of like, nah, dude, like I'm, I'm doing me. Like I know like you make your adjustments accordingly, but like you never second guess like the core of, of what makes you like a good pitcher. And I think early on I was like, I had no identity of like what I was supposed to do to be successful. And then you figure it out and you're like, all right, I can like, it's a stepping, I don't know, stool from here to be like a better pitcher, I guess. Yeah, it was like, even, even like the fidgety thing that I always get shit for too, like, I remember times where I was like, ha consciously thinking about not being too Dude, fidgety. Yeah, that's a perfect like, example too though. Oh, that honestly is I don't want like, to think I'm weird. Yeah, exactly, exactly. but that's weird. something like, almost too though to where like, if I'm not doing that, I'm not 100%. punching in the mouth either. Like, yeah. yeah, no dude, because I mean, we talked about it before too, like when in 17, we would like always face each other in the minor leagues mm -hmm. and like we could almost see each other pitch and just like, Dude, like that's Clevenger <laughs> at his at his like most full potential human. Was, Same with me though. Yeah, like, he was six eleven ninety two. Exactly. Like we would go yeah, up and just kind of lose it, and then like, but it was cool to like have that adjustment to where like you'd go to AAA, see like the potential, and then and then you'd kind of have the switch and like with anything. Yeah. Like you told me a few times, like dude, you're not being yourself. Yeah, you, I think once we figured you that were shit screaming out. in AAA after a punch out and shit, and in no, the big leagues, you get one rocked off the wall and strike out to whatever you. Have the same like demeanor going off the field, everything. Hundred like, percent. I was just like, yeah, like, act year, natural. Like, 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 yeah, you like, did it. Yeah, <laughs> I know exactly. Like, so, what do you think that moment was where you clicked and started being like Tyler Glass now? I think like once you like go through it enough to where you like suck enough times, you're kind of just like, all right, I'm sick of this. So, like, <laughs> it just seemed like it just happened organically, I guess. Like. There was a lot of times like in Pittsburgh, I would throw a game and be like, what are you, like after it, you know, when it's all said and oh, done and the dust settles there, like, and you're dude, just like, I what just the wait, f I yeah, wasted like, everything. I why, wasted. it's just like, the, yeah, it was like weird. And I just like kind of like lost the moment. And I think it just kind of happened organically to where it's just like, I don't know, you do bad enough and you've kind of hit your like relative rock bottom within like your performance, your baseball career. And you're like, all right, there has to be another way. And then I just think I kind of like, I don't know. It just seemed like it happened a couple games, and like once I got traded and I did it enough, it just seemed to like kind of, I don't know, it like turned into like a role, and then it just became like organic for me.